Did you know that researchers have deployed millions of mosquitoes from drones in Hawaii? Yes, roughly 40 million mosquitoes, all bred in laboratories and packed into biodegradable pods, have been dropped across remote forest floors in Hawaii as a part of an unprecedented effort to rescue Hawaii's rapidly vanishing native birds. The crisis traces back to the 1800s when an invasive mosquito species arrived on the islands, carrying avian malaria that devastated local bird populations. Many of Hawaii's most iconic species now hover on the brink of extinction. Traditional conservation methods have failed to halt the decline, pushing scientists toward a a radical new strategy. Inside controlled labs, researchers have been breeding male mosquitoes that do not bite and cannot spread disease. These modified males carry a biological twist. When they mate with wild invasive females, the resulting eggs fail to hatch. As a result, there are no larvae and no new mosquitoes, and no further spread of the deadly disease threatening the birds. To deliver them, drones release eight-foot biodegradable tubes, each loaded with a thousand of the lab-raised insects. Once the pods hit the forest floor, they break down naturally, allowing the mosquitoes to disperse safely into the environment. Conservationists describe the operation as a last resort intervention, taken only because every other option has been exhausted. The scale and ambition of the project have sparked debate, however. Supporters call it a vital lifeline for species that could disappear within years, while skeptics question the long-term implications of releasing engineered insects into fragile ecosystems. But with extinction looming, Hawaii has turned to biotechnology as its most urgent defense. Whether this bold experiment marks a turning point for endangered birds or a controversial new chapter in conservation remains a question scientists and the public are still reckoning with. Follow for more interesting news from around the world.